Greetings, this is Daniel Presedo for Adobe Photoshop and welcome to my YouTube channel. Move that toolbar over. You might find it highly useful. A coworker gave me a tip the other day. This is your toolbar here on the left side. I move it over, I'm right-handed, so I'm going to move it over here and lodge it in the middle. And I find it useful to be able to just grab a tool over here and then make different selections. Perhaps I'm going to change the color and not have to swing my mouse all the way back over here. I find it really useful. And maybe you'll find it useful as well. Crop, do any kind of touch-ups, you know, gradient tool, whatever it is, you know, that swinging back and forth across the canvas might save you a lot of time. And you know what? If you don't like it, you can always reset the workspace. You can save your workspace under Window Workspace. For example, maybe you're a graphic and web designer. You can always reset it there. Now you'll notice when I go back to the essentials, it's actually saved the state. It saves the last state, but you can always go back to that same menu and reset and it'll take you back to what the shipping versions of Essentials looks like. So that's just a quick tip. If you're really inclined to take a chance, you can move that toolbar over. You can move it anywhere you like. I'm going to move this over here. You can move these things around. You can undock it if you like. Dock it back. There are all kinds of ways to create your workspace, but I find the toolbar being on my dominant right-hand side to be easier to move around on the canvas, and hopefully you find this useful as well. That's the tip. Thank you for watching.